Welcome to our tutorial screencast. This is screencast number two, basic digitization. So what we're going to talk about today is how to take an aerial photograph and using the editor toolbar create polygons and lines that represent buildings and sidewalks based on what we see in the image tile. Okay, we're going to start out in art catalog. I've navigated to the folder with my aerial photograph. Right click, new, and then shape file. Let's name the shape file D poly and set the feature type to polygon. Okay, now we need to set the spatial reference. So click edit, import. We're going to import the spatial reference from the aerial photograph. Click add, apply, and OK, and OK once more. Okay, now let's create another one. Right click, new, shape file. Name this one D line. Set the feature type to polyline. Again, import the spatial reference. Okay, so now we have all three files that we need. So let's go over to ArcMap and add the files. Select the files. Click Add. Okay, so we're going to be using the Editor Toolbar. Mine's already activated, but to get to it, go to View, Toolbars, Editor. And actually, let's make sure the image is visible. There it is. And let's just zoom in on some part that we can digitize. So this is Western Kentucky University's campus. And let's digitize something around there. Okay, so what you're gonna do is go to the editor, start editing, make sure the task is set to create new feature and the target is set to D poly. And let's just zoom in here. Okay, click your pencil tool and start laying down points. So get the points, and then to end the shape, just double click on the last point, and it becomes a polygon. So let's go over here. So what if we had a little bit more complicated shape with this long, rounded arc? First, we're going to just lay down some of the, the straighter points. And then we get to this arc. So we're going to go up to our toolbox right here, and using that last point, click on the next point and then we can adjust this arc going back and forth so we're not going to be super accurate on this one but you get the idea so double click again and it becomes a polygon okay now we're going to digitize a sidewalk uh, this area looks good right here so change your target to D line and in the editor toolbar select the pencil tool again and actually this time we're going to use something called snapping and snapping makes sure that the lines that you're laying down conform to previous lines laid down so it just makes things like topology and networking easier later on so let's just start laying down the path of the sidewalk I'm not going to be super accurate on this one And it is the same way as the polygon, just double click to end. Okay, starting at that point, just go down this way, and pan down, and go up the sidewalk, and double click to end. Okay, so now we have two separate lines, and we want to merge them. In order to do that, just go up to the editor, merge, OK, and now they become one single line. And that's pretty much it. So let's just go up to the editor and stop editing. Actually, we're going to click uh, cancel when it asks us to save our edits and do it manually just to show you. So we've saved our edits and now we can stop editing. And let's just open up the attribute table to verify. Okay, so we have one polyline and two polygons as we expected. Those are the ones we created. 
And that's pretty much it. Those are the basics of digitization. So just make sure you always save your edits. And thank you for watching our tutorial screen.